Mm. Oh. I think this is the one I'm going to fuck up Sarkis. No approval. Not yet. Oh. No, he didn't text you. See, I, see what he does? Yeah, yeah, he's a joke. Look, nothing new. Did he say not approved? Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> did, he say not, did he say not approved? Not yet, no. Okay, then suck my <laughs> What happened? I'm fixing my letter. You Hello, can... guys. Welcome to the RDB podcast. Looks like right now we are on like a one week on, one week off kind of schedule. It's turning out to be. So two podcasts a month. Hopefully we'll catch up. Um, I had a very good valid reason to skip last week. I had to uh, remove my gallbladder. So right around my birthday, um, it was a planned operation. I had some uh, stomach pains and um, they call it gallbladder attacks. Um, my gallbladder was inflamed, had stones in it and all kinds of shit. So um, I had two CT scans, I had ultrasounds, I had all kinds of stuff. And I had my surgery last uh, last week, not last week, the Friday before that. So um, yeah, it was fun. The first Friday of April, April, basically April four or five, like five, April five is when I got my surgery. So um, I came. I don't know if I came. Did I come to work Monday? Yeah, you did. Remember, you came. You like couple you hours. Walk, yeah, you were gonna walk. Yeah, yeah. So I mean, uh, so Friday went to the went to Cedars Hospital and uh, had my surgery at around like noon. It was like an hour procedure. They had to do general anesthesia, which means put me to sleep. So that was the first time I've ever been uh, put to sleep. And uh, it was quite an experience. Honestly, you don't know anything. So it's kind of crazy. But when, when you wake up, like you were like dizzy for a few hours or no? When I woke up, I was dizzy for like not, mm. not even that long, like 15 minutes. That's maybe? it. I was dizzy for like 15 minutes. I, I saw I saw like a lot of videos of when people like they wake up, they they talk stuff like, is that true or no? No, I mean that's I don't know. That's with gas maybe. This one I had nothing like that. I didn't have any like weird thoughts. I don't remember hallucinating anything like that. It was normal. It was all normal. I even walked to the car, all that stuff. So if you guys don't know, the gallbladder stores the bile basically from your liver and the bile breaks down fatty foods and whatever. And uh, this is like, it's a genetic kind of thing as well. Um, and it happens definitely more with us Middle Easterns, I would say too. But uh, <laughs> cholesterol starts building like stones, stuff, stuff like that. And you can't get it out of your gallbladder if you have it, apparently, if it's a lot. So you have to remove your gallbladder. It's pretty common. And... Um, It's laparoscopic, the way I did it with the robot assisted. So they make three lacerations and stick in those things and they move organs around, move your intestines. I don't know what. I don't even want to think about that. But uh, And then they cut out your gallbladder and they pull it out apparently from like your belly button because my belly Fuck. button is like, uh, oh, it's like bruised pretty badly. Um, and yeah, so now I'm like, I don't know, 10 days into it and it's just itchy and sore. But the first two days sucked. Yeah. First two days sucked. Uh, they have to fill up your body with gas. So it expands and then they could operate easy. So that gas lingers in your body. And I've never even imagined how much pain gas inside your body does to you because it's, it's like loose air gas inside your body. And sometimes they do travel to my shoulders. Um, pretty intensive pain for like two days. You have to sleep on your back, which is also super annoying. I had to get that pillow that was like all um, makes you like sit straight and sleep. I couldn't bend over because the gas would like, it was crazy. But now I'm like, you know, 80% back to normal. And I haven't missed a day at work. Except for the Friday that I had surgery. Yeah. And most people don't even know that I had surgery. And it's a pretty serious surgery. It's not yeah. like a joke. So, um That's why I skipped the podcast because there was no way I was going to sit here and talk for an hour. And uh, we were also busy at the same time. So, yeah, that was my birthday story <laughs> this year. So, well, it's done. Eat healthier, guys. Um, I could tell you the gallbladder attack was not fun. It paralyzed me for a couple hours when I had it like three times. And that's when I got it checked. But, uh, yeah, I mean, 
after you turn 30, 35, like you got to check on yourself. You can't eat like you used to. We were eating garbage food here and uh, it caught up to me, caught up to me. And uh, that's it for my gallbladder. I am missing an organ now. <sighs> but And this guy still has it somehow. But they say, I don't know. <clears throat> It's important, but a lot of people say it's not important. I don't know. I don't get it. It's, it's, it's not important. necessary to live, with, yeah, without it. So, it's very, it's definitely important to have it. Why not? But um, if for, you have stones in your body, you got to get it out. Yeah. From my understanding, it trains your body to digest, and then yeah. after a while, it's useless. Yeah, I mean, basically, no, it still, it still holds bile from your liver and does its thing. But it's small too. It's not like very big. But um, I don't know. I've been eating much healthier so i've been okay i've ate pizza i ate a slice of pizza the other day and a cookie. i did have a little bit of stomach pains not gonna lie um so yeah all that i'm getting used to some of the stomach pains and different bowel movements and stuff um, but some people get really bad after they get like diarrhea for years or the rest of their life hopefully it doesn't happen to me so far so good so doesn't it happen like the night like four or five it days after? already like happening yeah no you're point. good so I think I've been eating shit so much that my body got used to it. But uh, yeah, I lost about 12 pounds in that literally two weeks of eating healthy. So yeah, I'm going to hopefully start working out again in May. Can't lift anything heavy for like a month. Um, so, you know, that's your whole core and your abdominal area. And when that's all messed up, I mean, you can't lift. So that sucks. But uh, in May, I'm going to start back up and hopefully... Get into the best shape of my life. That's the plan. But yeah. Moses is next to remove his gallbladder and his hair. It's true. Yeah. All that money spent on laser, nothing happened. I'm trying to see uh, if, uh, his, if his hair uh, works. It's a miracle. It stopped. Then RDB is opening a hair uh, center. Yeah, it's, it's, uh, we have, we have, I have six, seven more to go. And after that, we'll... Oh, you're still going. Repair yeah. design hair. <laughs> oh, RDH. Remember RD Beards? RD Beards. Wow. We still have the Instagram. Yeah. Don't, don't, <laughs> don't look at it, you guys. Don't go on there and don't follow, please. <sighs> That's funny. But, um, oh, yeah. RD we'll Beards. Here. Yeah. Shut up. There's a lot. There's a lot going on at the shop. <laughs> <laughs> a lot. <laughs> We're having a full conversation. Marty Beard, shut up. He's like, oh, he's he dying. Did. Look. Oh, he is. Oh, oh, you asshole. You went on there. I told you. That's like, there. that's probably like six years yeah, ago. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you can tell the last post. Dude, was it like, was, it was kind of taking off and we just stopped. Yeah. Six, 646 likes. Yeah. I'm telling you, it was good. <laughs> the goal was to make like special sprays for your beard, but I don't know. Maybe we do RDB hair products. I mean, yeah. I mean, that's the only you thing know, left where we don't do. Maybe well, we shall. Or soaps. RDB soaps. We, you we can do, do your really beard and man, your car. We do really manly so, fucking soaps. There's yeah. some out there and they all we suck. We tried so many of them. <laughs> so, I even tried the, the what is the Sasquatch deodorant. That fucking thing sucks too, to be honest. But um, yeah, I don't know. We need like a cool men's Did we do fragrance? Airline. Yeah. No, it was a... Car no. spray, car spray. We did. We, no, we didn't. We didn't. It's it's, it's a we big thing. We did the air fresheners. Air fresheners. Air fresheners yeah, but, but no, we never got into the spray. That, so. No, man. It's the we competition were, is just so so. It's, it's really yeah. Hard. But like Vic says, there's hold on. We were though good. We, we were working on it. Yeah, but th never mind. Oh, what? Like Vic says, but there's not much. There is. It just uh, they they all suck. I mean, you just um, have to brand it. You have to. You know. Yeah. I think the best one. Your father has one. Um, gentleman, that's the name. For what? What are you talking? <laughs> about? Uh, like the um, the old deodorant. Yeah, that's the only one. I mean, I used to use like Old Spice. You know what, bro? For you I, I, I'm, you know what? Axe, man. I don't care. I, well, there's that the smells axe, the yeah. best. The powder one is the best, and Which I don't know one do why. Is it natural or is it no? Uh, no, it's, it's totally not, not natural. Okay, well, the behind the Sasquatch thing is natural. Oh, like, okay, okay. Uh, so it doesn't work well because we don't want to keep putting like aluminum inside. Oh, your own, but. well, yeah, but, but I don't know why we're talking about deodorant. But I don't know. Let's make a carbon fiber soap or something. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely <laughs> not. But um, I don't know. Some cool fucking. Men's care stuff, man. Us men need fun stuff too. Uh, the girls' industry is 
fucking unlimited. Uh, we need some. We need some stuff. So uh, I don't know. Either we do it on our own or somebody to team up with it would be a lot of fun. But yeah. um, we're looking for new business ventures on the side, of course. Oh my god, there's carbon never, fiber soap. Let me see. Okay, I'm done. Anything? Really? Think of any possible. Th- think of anything. No way. Think of carbon any fiber socks <laughs> soap. <laughs> soap, yeah. dude, not socks. How soap. do you fucking wash yourself with carbon fiber? I don't understand. <laughs> no, it's like the color of carbon fiber. Oh, the color, like it's like carbon fiber. So it's like a soap bar that you wash your hands and it's carbon fiber. It's Hold on, what the man. fuck? You see that oh, shit? Man, there is. You know, you know oh, what? There's uh, stone. The, 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 there's a yeah. It's think of something, anything. It's out there. I don't know. That, you no, need, like you need to make like a skims skims for men, like a t-shirt, but it's like built in under it. I don't what do you mean? Oh, like make you look skinny? Yeah. There's a lot of it. Like they go on Amazon. Is it? Yeah. I've thought. I've thought about. Think don't, of don't any- even skims making for men too at this point. I don't know. They should <coughs> think of anything and then put it on Google. It's sold. Whatever. There's always a way. <laughs> There's always a way for something. <laughs> right now, everybody's selling on Amazon just like no name gadgets and no name shit all day long. But uh, another thing I want to get into is like children's, um, basic coloring books. Like informative stuff, anything like that. It would be kind of cool to get into something like that because that does really well. Coloring books apparently is a huge industry. Yeah. Also, there's another thing that I was thinking about, but there's nothing. It's like cool watches for kids, <laughs> right? But it has a tracker on it. I know Apple has it. I, I get it. But imagine a cool one. Like it's a cool watch and then you can track like and Labels. when they press a button, it alerts you like if they need help. Yeah, I mean, you know, right? You know what I'm I've saying? That's pretty cool. Like that, there man. is, but they're not like cool colors and like skins on it. Like, I don't know, man. I don't know why we got into talking about <coughs> side products, but um, 20 days there's gonna be like that out there just because of this. That's fine. Uh, we don't have money, it doesn't matter. Um, so what's what's up with your new car? So, I guess, no, let's not announce it yet. <laughs> let's have them like guess and we'll do like a giveaway. We'll give somebody like a hat oh, he, he was, I was just joking, I didn't even know. Okay. Yeah. It was what? I just threw something out. Your new car. I didn't even know. He or he got a new car. But oh, I don't know. I just threw yet. something out. Oh, okay, cool. I heard it somewhere, but I just didn't. So I don't know if we should do that on YouTube or the podcast, but we should have like a guessing game. No, I think. Yeah, we'll stick to YouTube. On the next YouTube episode, uh-huh. yeah. we will do a giveaway where somebody has to guess Sarkis's new car to the like exact model. It has to be like exactly yeah. what it is. Um, we can give him like a hint. If you give them a no, hint, no, they're going to no get it hints, right. No hints. There's not that many cars out there. No, no, SUV. Something it's like over that. It's over 100 grand. It's over 100 grand is all I'm going to say. It's an SUV? Yeah. Oh, okay. I it's, a, it's a car. It's over 100 grand. So Kia. Okay. And, well, these um, days everything is over 100 grand. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So Kia. Yeah. So the giveaway, will be, we'll figure out what it is. A hat, maybe, or something. Hoodie, shirt. I don't know. But um, we will do that on the next YouTube uh, yeah, you, Let's just do it on the YouTube. It's much better. Yeah, it's fine. We'll do that. Is it coming by? It's going to be here in eight. Uh, yeah, next Thursday it will be here. Oh, my God. No, no. So the, we'll do eight the, days. For the YouTube after, it would be nice to show the car. Yeah, it's gonna, if we do it. Okay, so if we do it next week. By the way, it's another very stupid decision. <laughs> Just letting <laughs> it is. you guys know. It's uh, nice Financially, story. and I think like it's not even that cool, but whatever. It's probably dumber than this one. Oh, it I, is I got the wheels too. It's also more expensive. He got the right. wheels too. I got the oh, you got the wheels? Yeah. And he right. hates that the wheels. Which one? What did you get? He was making fun of it. You got wheels already? Okay, you, get, you have to cut this portion. You have, or, to, you have to cut it. No, no. Who cares no, about the wheels? No, no. No, no. This, I'm going to say it. You I don't care. It. Fuck the wheels. I don't care. No, the last time you hit it, remember you said talking shit about it? Unless it's RDB wheels, then I don't give a fuck. No, no. It was uh, the last time on the other car. You Is it RDB wheels? No. The, fuck them. No, no, he was talking about the shit. He, bro, we designed it. We designed another one. What? What are you talking about? Uh, just fucking say the story. No, but he's recording it. They don't want to cut it. That's why. Okay, I don't know what. Okay, to say it off okay. camera. Okay, it's okay. off of another car. Another another car. We did another that car. we did here. Oh my god! He contacted. The guy. He bought. He bought it from. Him. Bullshit! He bought it from. Him. This is your stupid fault because your customer. No, no. 
I, did I did I call him? No, no, I did. I swear to God. How did you get the number? No, 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 because he called a long. He's long using time. our shop and getting wheels. Yeah, yeah, but I don't even know which which. I don't even. Fucking, no, no, I don't customers even wheels, bro. I don't even it. talk to no, the no, guy he, anymore. No, no, he called. <laughs> it was like eight. Think months. about a car that we did. Uh huh. And wheels, and then we took. Okay, them just off. cut this part. Okay, so nine months ago he called. He was selling the wheels. Oh my God, L. No. Starts with the L, the customer? No. No. Hiya. Same car, bro. This guy wanted to sell his wheels. Wheels? He t I told him, like, I'm nobody's buying, buying it. No one's buying it. So I told him, I will give you an offer. He's like, okay. You know, 2500 2500 For the set, which is still stupid. It's, it's terrible. Fan is outside. Is it factory? Oh, crap. Huh? Is it factory wheels or aftermarket? No, aftermarket. Anyways, whatever. Um, it's not good, 2500 it is what it is. It's going to be a funny talk conversation. We'll talk about all this okay. when the car happens. But yeah. Um. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I had as much confidence as he had like in my like paycheck. I mean. It's not about the confidence about your paycheck. Yeah, bro, no. How, okay, how, bro, you, you, know, you know, I don't blame him. Okay, hold on. How much money do you spend on alcohol, nothing, drugs, restaurants? Nothing, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna answer with for him because I, I did. I, he doesn't spend money on anything except um, cameras. Cam, well, that's a job. That's no, different. bro, I saw him be buying alcohol. Me? Yeah, that was for him. No, I don't drink. Whatever, man. Our uh, Mansory Phantom hit 13.3 million. Oh, that's crazy. Reels, real views, and then 1.1 million likes, which is like pretty serious. Um, I missed that car. I went to Vegas, and it went to Coachella also right now. Uh, but it's in uh, Coachella really cool now. Times. It's well, Coachella's over, so it's back. But yeah. like stagecoach is next, right? Or no, Coachella week two, weekend two, and then stagecoach. Um, what do they do in Coachella? They party, that party. Day. Yeah, they pass festival, out. music festival. If it's I would, look, if I was single, I would go. If I was the single, thing is, go. you gotta you gotta do like. No, I don't want to say saying. drugs, but like you got to be like drunk or something. Can't you, go to, you can't go to Coachella no, sober, right? You you drink. Is there people yeah, like sober there? Or no? Yeah, but you die then they like I think die everyone's, out. everyone's mm, drunk out. I mean, I did it five years ago. Um, and honestly, it was a lot of fun. But also, I, I went with like a super like hooked up. You know, you go in the back and everywhere you go, go trailers up. and stuff like that. So everywhere you go hooked up, it's fun, man. Yeah, yeah, he's right. I right. just again wouldn't go again unless I was single, which is not gonna happen. Our camera guy Joe went, remember? He yeah, almost died. No, I've never been to Coachella. I've never been to like. I've been. In like I only been to one lot. concert. No, I've been to like four concerts and it was just. It's like cool because you're just never going been. in straight somewhere and it's like you go and listen to this or that and this and like different type of music and then at night also there's different parties. I mean, you, you it's it's fun. It's not. It's twenty four hours. Coachella, no, it closes at night, but then there's like a lot of house parties. There's a lot of other parties that companies put on. So you get to go day and night. Where do you I sleep? Think, I think the best place is the Lake you Havasu. You rent something, I don't know. They're all naked. <laughs> Fuck this place. Huh? Lake Havasu. But you have to have a boat. You have, a really you have to have a bat. No, boat, not a bat. Boat and bat. Boat and bat. So it's really expensive. <laughs> it's an expensive uh, thing. I don't know. But okay, put Lake Havasu. Why, spring oh, break. Why are you the way that you are? Hold on. Just put Lake Havasu, Arizona, spring break. Bro, you guys going to love this. <laughs> yeah, they're all naked because well, it's poor. It's freaking. <laughs> oh, my God. It's Pornhub, bro. Chill. It's not. Yes, it's Pornhub, the first one. Images. This is, this is where you do every day. This, oh, that's the thing. Uh, okay. That's the real Why are we looking at that? This? Oh, click on that one. This picture. Yeah, yeah. No problem. All right? Up, up. No. One more. That one. This is, this is what it you is. You want to come today? Okay, so that and then one bald Armo okay. guy in the middle of all that. Oh, shit. Okay, how are you going to tow it? And then Moses is fucking... Who, bro, you should be... So, sorry, so who, who has sex with you? No one. Look, this is a, you have to throw uh, some beans I mean, on it. Let's get into cars, yeah, because you, you have to throw some dirty. beans on it. Yeah, beans. <laughs> it's like a round thing. With like a, yeah, like I'll beans, do it tomorrow. Bro, beans. <laughs> no beans. Okay, like, that's what you call. I think. What? I don't know, we, I don't know what you call that. Beads, beads, bro, beads yeah, and they take off their like whatever. Fuck. What? It's fun. You give them beans, and then they take <laughs> off their. <laughs> 
Imagine we have to get beans and go to go, but here's some beans, pinto beans. Can I see your tit? Yeah. <laughs> Fuck. You want some full? Um, I eat it. So let's get into some topics because this is, after all, we're a car channel somewhat and uh, we should talk about cars. Um, been doing a lot of uruses again, wide body uruses, but uh, yeah. Um, Let's talk about this, the last Huracan. I posted this on my Instagram at one point. It's called the uh, STJ, Super Trofeo Jota. Shit. Or is it Jota? I don't know. It's Jota, I think. But uh, they're only making 10 of these. So thankfully, it's not like a crazy full production, another Huracan. Um, it looks like the STO, but the wing is raised a little bit more. Um, same engine and just better suspension. Really, that's what it is. And only 10. And the so, price is like six hundred, seven hundred thousand. Well, I mean, this is just for like these the crazy collective. Does the J stand thing. for the same thing as the SVJ? Yeah, I think so. Right? Yeah, my because it has to be right. The, STJ is the Super Trofeo Jota, uh -huh. and then the SVJ is the Super um, Veloce Jota, whatever. Got it. Okay, cool. Veloce. I like that. I like that how they made this. I'm saying it all fucking wrong. For it doesn't me. matter. It looks but uh, yeah, I mean, thankfully the Huracan is done. This my is the bad. last one. That's it. Yeah. Yeah, it was a long run, and it they, did well. It did well. It did well, and then um, the STO came out. STO was sick, but uh, yeah. Other than that, that's it with that. And then the Aventor's done already. Revuelto's on the way. Um, the Revuelto's have landed in the U.S., but they're not being released. We have so many customers waiting. Uh, we have literally a body kit like waiting for Revuelto, and we're gonna try to debut one by uh, Car Week. We'll see. So, so what's gonna be uh, instead of this hurricane? Go down. They have they leaked the new name of the hurricane. It's called. It's in your notes. It's the second part of that. Yeah. Uh, the new model is thought to be called Temerario. Fuck. What the fuck? The name is Spanish <laughs> and translates to reckless, because the revato means unruly, and the hurricane's gonna be reckless. It's like the little kid that's reckless, and the dad is unruly. I guess I don't know. Um. But yeah, um, it's okay, expected it like to lose the bro. V10 and it go for like V8. A, look like a Just Ferrari. Weird. The vents and everything, the side. The vents. Beans and vents. Looks like a Mitsubishi Eclipse. Get some beans and then look at these vents. It looks like a Ferrari. Fuck. Okay. So we <sighs> Stealing 1.2 million with a rack and laptop? Rock. What? Oh, why, why am I fucking I'm blind right now? gallbladder makes you blind, uh, with a rock and laptop. So, eight cars, including a 23 Challenger Demon, were stolen from a dealership in Alabama. Did I read that right? Arab, Alabama. What the fuck? No wonder you're I crazy. First yeah. of all, why is there a city named Arab in <coughs> fucking Alabama? I, I know. I never knew that existed. And really? Is it like <laughs> white people or is it like Arabs that live there? No, it's white. <laughs> Population of Arab, four Arabian... Oh, oh my God! It's like four Arabs that Hank's cousins that have four hundred thousand white people. Yeah, it's definitely white people. Welcome to the Arab. Ah, shit! Oh my God! Oh wait, donuts? wait! Oh, it's it looks like a couple of dark people. It's way up there. Is it a nice area? I mean, oh, it's small. <laughs> Is that it? Yeah. That's the whole town. <laughs> That's the whole town. You're, are you serious? But I love that little town. So that it's place cool. got robbed. Like yeah, wait, that place that's is the weird. one that has this crazy yeah. dealership with that d demon in there? Yeah, no, that's not the whole city, bro. This is downtown. Can't be, bro, they have a football field. They're fo fo oh, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> See, the thing is, man, when you hang around, uh, what? Okay, that's common. They have tornadoes over there, apparently. And they have what? Alabama, tornadoes. Okay. Um, <laughs> anyways, two of them were recovered, with one <laughs> being found in an apartment complex. <laughs> 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 okay, can you uh, no, We've talked about this. How many weeks he doesn't stop coughing? No, no, forget about it. Watch the first podcast we've ever done. He's coughing. He and doesn't he, stop coughing. Maybe five years he hasn't stopped coughing. Yeah, he hasn't stopped cough. There's something in your respiratory system yeah. that is eating away. It's probably um, the gambling alcohol and, and the other thing. thing. All that money you spend on hair, <laughs> diets, all that shit, stop and just go get that looked at. 
When's the last time you got like a it's any blood type of test? Any blood test? Yeah, blood test. No. When? What was the last time? Long time. Like, <clears> like <throat> ten years? Less, maybe. Hold on. Well, like hold on. There's the a apocalypse. There's a, there's is there's an investigation. Investigators. Six, there. seven years ago, I think. Okay, maybe get blood some blood work. Make Bro, sure. Bro, honestly, I I will get blood tests, uh, uh, blood work every like six months, is what I'm gonna do. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I get once. I get once a year. No, I know we have, we have to. to. Yeah. I do yeah. blood tests once a year. Yeah, it's mandatory. I just gotta go and they, they give me like medicine and stuff I'm short of and so because I'm sometimes I'm very down, you know. What the fuck is that sound? Corvette. Maybe the guy's here. Is that car that no. loud? The Corvette, we have to move it anyways on the street, no? The guy's coming. Pick it up. Yeah, I think he's... I mean, that could be the Corvette, yeah, you guys. Is. is anybody downstairs? Mike's downstairs. Yes. Okay. Um, anyway, we're still fucking... Uh, two of them recovered. Thieves used a rock to break a window in the service bay, found the main camera hub and turned off all the cameras and erased the footage. Sick. Smart. Uh, they plugged the laptop into the key safe and hacked it, taking 330 keys from the safe and putting them in a bag. They hopped in the cars they wanted and started them driving right off the lot. That's fucking, these guys are well planned in yeah. Arab, Alabama. Yeah. It has to be an inside game, no? No suspects have been arrested and the dealership <coughs> is offering a 10K reward. No questions asked. That's it? Only 10K? Or the return of the rest of the keys. I think they just stole all the keys from the dealership and then just, and just they hopped in cars. They hopped yeah, in cars that genius. push the start. That's so smart instead of like trying to figure out. What are you out. looking for? Grab all of them? Start it, oh, give the bag to the other homie and start the other car and then boom, boom, boom. Keep passing the up. bags. Damn. Yeah. Smart. But I, I, I don't think you put this in your list. I saw this also earlier. Is uh, Was it on Facebook Marketplace? Yeah, Facebook Marketplace. Somebody put a McLaren 720 um, for sale for 40 grand. And essentially, he put in the comments saying, um, you know what it is. If you know, you know. And it says there's no tracker in it and it drives and, you know, you could take it as you want for 40 grand. So basically it's a stolen McLaren and he's selling it for 40 grand. Like, you know, just take it. They, uh, they got, I don't uh, know why no. he should have put 40 grand. Uh, she should have put $40,000. And when he gets calls, they, oh, my bad. It's a typo, but we can make a deal. Come, let's talk. Why do they say that on, on he, the he also wrote, he also wrote in the listing that um if you want to do a claim on your car, we do it for free. So basically they'll jack your car for free. So oh my god, this car's been around. The fuck is wrong with these people? No, they're, they're, look, the thing is people need money and they're doing whatever to make money. They got my friend's GTR last weekend. Mm -hmm. the, um whenever the first was. They out of his apartment complex, like with a gate, everything, snuck in. They had already like copied the key or something. Took the car. They found it in uh, Victorville. Stripped? No, they luckily caught it before they started stripping it. So he got it back. That's crazy. I was shocked that he got it back. Yeah, it's getting wild out there. But um, yeah, that Facebook thing is crazy. Yeah. yeah. Ow. First, custom Revolto. Oh. It's. I think this was more to like show off what they could customize like in. The Lamborghini thing. The models created in Lamborghini's in-house customization shop to show how detailed customers can go. Combo of gray with details in green and black. The Italian flat colors on the under of the wing. I mean, yeah. I don't even know what that means. If Lamborghini did it, then... Yeah, I mean, not, it's not really a custom... Like, I don't know. That looks good, though. I just like the rear. I love this Wow. Car. This is going to be my nice. new favorite car, 100%. For sure. And I'm sure it drives, like, really good. Um, but excited to do these for sure. Like I said, we're going to do wide body kits on them, by the way. It's going to be a wide body kit. It's going to be all kinds of shit. Which one is better, this one or the SVG? I think SVG. No, man. This. Some people are going to be like, no hybrid, blah, blah, blah. But like, dude, it's, it's just it's just what it is. It's a new game, man. Can't be behind. You know? So I don't care that it's a hybrid. Well, it like SVG, Actually, I like it better. SVG more wider than this? Except then when your battery dies. Like the SF90s are fucking mm. bad. <coughs> but um, it's going to be a lot of stuff with the Revolto. So <laughs> stay tuned. Let's go for the first Koenigsegg designed on Microsoft Paint. The first Koenigsegg was designed on Microsoft Paint. That's sort of what I was doing a yeah. long time ago. But um, in 1994... Christian Koenigsegg was using his IBM computer 
and Microsoft Paint to design a mid-engine lightweight two-seater with a removable and storable roof. 1994. Pretty cool. Uh, two years after, the first concept was driven in public, and in 1999, they moved to a real shop. So that's, yeah, it's definitely over 24 years. In 2002, their first production engine took the world record for horsepower, and the body won a Red Dot Design Award. In 2022, for the company's 30th, they unveiled the CC850, the hypercar that can be driven in manual or automatic. So that was, I remember that was at Car Week. Pretty crazy stuff. I still have yet to see like anybody own that though. I don't think anybody actually has one. I don't think it's finished yet. Yeah. Production. But that thing was cool. You could switch from automatic to manual. Like real manual, not like paddle shifter. Oh, shit. Yeah. Pretty cool. Oh, How oh, would that work? I, I don't they know. Should be, they should do it now. And they're like new cars, BMW, Mercedes. That's or, like crazy money. That car's $30 million at least. So. Shit. <laughs> Most but that's stuff you could do it, but uh, not on regular cars. Like, Most can get it. Yeah. $3 million for a car. Yeah. Fuck no. Sell your house. Yeah. It's okay. very. Great. I have to owe money if I do that. Yeah. No, oh. you're both houses if you sell it. You're both houses. Both. <laughs> both house, beans, and vans. Vans. <laughs> all right let's get into some videos <laughs> near crash of the week oh no there we looks, go a mclaren looks, 720 yeah. this looks bad already a modified mclaren 720 bad oh, yeah what is he doing why did he turn like that well no he lost oh he lost fucking control. raining and he's punching the car what do you think is gonna happen sir aren't they supposed to have good handling well it's raining still I mean, it's raining. He's, I mean, it's pouring rain. Oh, he's so lucky. <laughs> yeah, he got very lucky. Damn. That would have been a bad day. Um, uh, it, <laughs> McLaren suck. Oh, my favorite. My favorite. Lowest car ever. This is, uh, yeah. What the hell is that? <laughs> I'm sure maybe you guys, some of you guys saw this. Look at that thing. Dude, it's so sick. It's like trippy, right? Yeah, it's Super, scary. Like, trippy. Yeah. <laughs> So there's a guy in there. Like, what? Yeah, 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 yeah. There's Call a guy him. in there in a very awkward position, I think. Yeah. Well, there's pictures of him on Google. How he's sitting. If you guys want to so basically like hell? a little go-kart kind of thing inside of it. And he's like laying half in it. I don't know. They're driving it. Cutting it and tinting it is very easy. We could do that right now with Moses' Camry or this Cressida. Let's and, do it. Um, do it. Should we try it? We should. No. We have you guys have to see how he's sitting. Where this it? account doesn't show anything. It's just like oh, it doesn't. A, I don't think so. Um, I just randomly saw it on this account today. There's a red one too. One. There was a red one that they made. Did you see the red one, Hank? There's been a bunch of these. Yeah, the red one is actually has a GoPro in there, and so you can see how he's sitting. Yeah, it's like sideways. It's the only way you can sit or lay. I mean, yeah, and you could obviously you're, you can't drive that thing. Really, anywhere except a yeah. show like that. Yeah, yeah. I guess. you can't. It can't handle bumps. It can't ha like the tire is like very small. It's so like what's a, the point of that shit? So it look. Do, do you don't it's think it's hilarious. cool? It's fucking. It's so cool. It looks like a glitch. Like it's a video game glitch. Yeah, yeah. It looks like you're. But it's uh, real life. Yeah, your graphic card can't handle the game, so it kind of like disappears. Thank God you can't hear the audio on this because the guy's whistling very annoyingly the whole time. Like <laughs> he has like a real whistle, and he's just blowing it the whole fucking time. They're trippy. They're scared someone's going to step on this thing. Like, <laughs> If I was wherever that was, I would just drive it fast into people. Do you know they'll flip over? Yeah. So how does he get out? Right. They so can't do sick. anything. They can't stop you. That's sick. Does that door open? How does and it it's a Honda, no, 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 no. but it's he, a Honda, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah, and he gets out from the, uh, the uh, rear glass. The rear glass opens up and he slides out. It's, there's a video of it. I can't believe it. That's, this is popular. Another one's not. You don't have Another the video, Hank? It's he yeah. does. I mean, it's it's all over the internet on YouTube. You can see it. I mean, uh, yeah, on YouTube. I couldn't find it. Really? No. Here, let me see. I'll maybe send you the link into when, while you guys are talking. Or I might have it saved. It's here. fine, man. We're gonna now watch a guy that built the whole house. Apparently. Oh, I want to see this. Fuck the car. I want to see this too. Moses Your dad. So have you seen this? Oh, it's like a homeless thing. Bro, he built a house, dude. <laughs> no, no, no. Wait, wait. You're gonna trip out. What How? The fuck? He has central AC. Hold on. 
Watch. Shut the fuck. You're up. gonna see right now. Oh my god! It's but who's pro- in whose property? All it, it's all, it's by the river and it's everyone's junk. It's on That's the side it. of the 101. This guy right here built this, the whole house. What the fuck? Props to him, man. It reminds me of Felix with the mask on. I mean, it's illegal. But they all hundred percent illegal. hundred percent illegal. But they're not doing anything because this guy it actually looks good. Like he has, it looks like a house. Oh, they're gonna they're gonna now that this is out, they're gonna come after him. Oh yeah, can't let that slide now. No, oh my God, he's you, stealing electricity. No, too. no, you guys don't understand. He has <laughs> fire extinguishers everywhere. There's, it, it, he has all code. It's coded. Get it? Definitely not coded, bro. I mean, obviously, where he's where you can't he, change a window without a permit. <laughs> <laughs> by the bridge, I think. Or by the river, I think you can do everything. Yeah. Yeah. Look, he has a bed. Here's the rule: where homeless, unfortunately, homeless people have more rules, uh, less rules and laws than us regular. Hard Look, working. toilet, but bathroom, flushing, like you put a drain, like everything. He's got like a chain system to get stuff across the river. <laughs> yeah. Does he? Yeah. He has a zip line to go across? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. He try. he be, like moves things around. Like if he finds something, he throws it, he goes right into his house. What is happening? I bet you if we did this, we'd get caught in about five minutes. Somebody would come what after us. Sorry. You can't drive with front window tins. But you could build a house on the fucking LA River. Yeah, how how do they let that go? Because we have money to give them, and they yeah. don't. Yeah, that it's all about money, fucking California. If they go and if they go and shut them down, but what what are they going to gain? Nothing's happening. Nothing. They're going to lose money. Yes, cleaning up. But the if they come after you, they're going to find your ass. They're going to yeah. get you. The way this life works is so backwards. It's not even fucked up. Hopefully shit changes. Trump 2024. <laughs> Wait, are we going to get hate for that? No, all, everybody I know wants Trump. I've, I've never seen a Biden supporter. I mean, at this point, come on, guys. Everybody. <laughs> come on. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> come on, dude. The come fuck? on. I don't think anybody likes Biden. I've no, okay, Please, no. uh, if you want to get harassed, comment if you're pro-Biden. On our, I don't disagree. We, we do have some. There can't be anybody the, the, that's who's supporting Biden. Biden's doing a good job. Crazy. Crazy, yeah. It's not. It's not real. Biden has done no shit. I took a picture of the groceries that I bought the other day. That it was like two hundred fifty dollars, and it literally fit on top of my stove. It was. It's unreal. Yeah, there's a five hundred dollar toothbrush. What? Yeah. Have you seen it? No way. I wanted to get like a new electric toothbrush. There's a five hundred dollar toothbrush. <laughs> what the heck? It it you look at your phone and it tells you which teeth you're cleaning. Get the fuck out! I'm not gonna do that shit. Bro. And it and it <laughs> get the fuck what? here, bro. <laughs> No way. Get the fuck. It tells you which teeth you're cleaning and Shit. overall which ones you don't. So like over time you have to focus more on that. Like and it yeah, tells bro. you how strong you're doing it and to like do it less strong. It's f- 500 bucks. Oh, cut that. What? Okay. That's not. I just cut that. This is the one? I don't know if it's yeah, I guess it's 475. Jeez. There was a $700 too. So I didn't see a seven hundred dollar one. Oh, okay, go back, go back. Seven forty six. How right nuts there. is that? Honestly, right there, 746. I mean, I mean, what it is ma- that? It makes sense because your teeth are important, right? Oh, oh it's, it's just a, a it's, crazier addition. Yeah, it's live a, coaching, bro. It coaches you to brush your teeth. Right there, seven forty six. If a toothbrush could coach you to brush your teeth, I could coach you to do many better things. Wow. Wow. <sighs> I saw this one, but cheaper than that. I don't, I don't know why it's so expensive here. But yeah, there's basically $500 toothbrushes out there, electric, and it does nothing really. I don't know. It's shocking. I mean, think of it. They sold pet rocks. The guy made like millions and millions of dollars. So I think this is fair. A pet rock, bro. Remember? Who remembers yeah. the pet rock? It's a rock that's a pet. You can make anything with the right marketing. Marketing, yeah. So, yeah. We're all fucked. What is this? Uh, crash of the week times two. Oh, this McLaren one. Is it bad? Yeah, this one is a Malibu right here. Oh, my God. Um, they've been trying very hard to do Malibu like car meets. And they finally pulled like another one off. And a guy leaving it crashes into a parked car. It almost hits a cop. Oh, really? Oh, shit. We can. Yeah, the McLaren punched it, and I mean it's ironic that both car 
crash videos are McLaren's, by the way. See the cop right here? Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Damn. Uh, that's so awkward. And I heard the guy tried to run away for a second or two and just... Yeah, he, he was acting real shady. Oof, that's bad. That's bad. It sucks, man. I mean, poor guy was there for fun and just don't punch your car, man. It's a, what is it? I think it was a 600? Yeah, it's an older no, no, McLaren. It's a, Why can't they just drive normal and have fun? They got a little stupid That's stuff. the guy, and he was, like, fighting with people because, obviously, he's... They're, they don't want to yeah, film he's, it. He's like, don't yeah, go there's, take pictures. There's, like, so many, like, little assholes all around, too, that are probably, like, just laughing at his face. It's, it's a shitty situation. And yeah, but he made that choice, didn't he? I know, I know, and you're kicking somebody when they're down, and... I get it. Somebody could have been hurt. All that stuff is very wrong. But them filming is wrong and him driving it doesn't matter. Everybody's yeah, wrong yeah. here. Yeah, I definitely will ne first of all, I don't really go to car meets because of this kind of thing. Um, but if I do I drive even slower than speed limit, put it that way. So it gives people more time to see my car. Right? If you're punching it. But nowadays every car's fast, man. It's like what are you showing off, you know? Yeah, it's like they've never seen a Older McLaren before? Yeah. Oh, the the thing he could have felt like it looks on the yeah. rear. It looks like that old McLaren, that MC. No, it's the it's the oh my God, I'm blanking out. It's the. It's not a bad McLaren. It's an, it's a it's a good one. So yeah. Yeah, it looks like a MP412C. Yeah. That. But with the front, the front is the, is like in the other one though. I can't fucking tell. Yeah, see? I don't know. I don't care for McLaren. Sorry, guys. But um, anyways, two-man super bike racing. I didn't know this existed. I did not know either. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. He's <laughs> literally, like, loose, and he's just fucking balancing in the back. If this guy falls, he's dead. Yeah. Oh, 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 what are you doing? Your ass. Well, he's doing it for the balance. Oh, smart. Okay. I was like, what, what if like your foot slips wherever you're putting your foot? It feels so sketchy. I think these guys want to die. <laughs> That's a weird <laughs> ass fucking story. Why would they even add that? That's so. Uh, Apparently, this is like a whole thing. thing. Uh, yeah. Jesus Christ. Oh, my God. Jesus. They look sick, though. Why did you stop with your kid for your kid? <laughs> with the seat? What the fuck is I that? I don't know. And All they right. have and they have helmets like it matters. <laughs> it does. It does definitely matter. Yeah. Fall off and turn like this. It matters. <laughs> it doesn't matter when you fly out the bike. You're not gonna have legs or arms. <laughs> Why would, yeah, do you want your head, head after that? I mean you could live with just your head. <laughs> <laughs> If your head is gone, you can't live. Oh, I saw this. Never mind. Did you see that streamer that doesn't have arms and, and legs, but no. he plays uh, Warzone? Yeah. He controls that. it with his mouth. That's so sick. And he fucks people up, too. Yeah, no, he's yeah, yeah. good at it, too. It's crazy. It? Mm -hmm. He just, he controls it with his mouth. Yeah. Everything. It's so sick. Like, he's so, like, I said, uh, one, like, a grandpa is playing. He's killing everyone. He does that with his tongue, but. Yeah. 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 <laughs> God. He wins. Hey, don't, don't laugh, bro. You do with your tongue, too. No. Cut that bitch. <laughs> no tongue. 450. Still do. You, just, you both do different things, though. Yeah. Well, one's inner, one's outy. <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> fuck you, Hank. <laughs> fuck did I do? What did he do? Dad? <laughs> I'm the problem. The fuck did I do? Bro, did you Wait. guys notice there's a like you know, this is the, like a third a cyber shack they're doing 30s? On okay, the, I'm done. Okay, this is I'm, a okay, that's Cyprus, it. That's Cyprus. It, that's it. <laughs> Bins? This is a Cyprus truck. Cy Cyprus truck? Yeah, Cyprus truck. But I went cyber. to Nobu Malibu for my friend's birthday and there was five cyber trucks. Yeah, it's very bad. They're, they're getting, selling, it's right? Like, it's, it's just so bad. Everybody that ordered, it's coming in. I'm 100%, 50% regretting. They were asking 300 grand online. Yeah. And now it's so like 150. Great. You get it for like 150 right now. What does that stupid thing have anyway? Nothing. I mean, it's cool, but yeah, it's, I don't know. There's one Tesla modder, mo mo modeler, eh, bro. Modeler. Damn. Also, the problem with that car is you can't go anywhere with it. It's so like long and big yeah, and awkward. Yeah. 
Like drop Te- off your kid to school with a cyber truck. Tesla Not Model anything. Three, brand new, zero down, four hundred a month. Go get it. Sick. That's what it's supposed to be on like thirty four hundred dollars a month for Sarkis. Yeah, that's insane. You guys zero down, and they throw in the self driving for free. It was 200 bucks a month for self-driving. Anyway, yeah. we have a serious SF90 project we're going to be dropping shortly. It's going to be oh, really dope. One. We haven't done a crazy one for a minute, and this one is going to be crazy. It is the first of its kind in the world. 1016 Industries' first body kit for the SF90. It hasn't even been put on a car yet. Like We're kind of guinea-pigging it, um, but it's going to be crazy. And we're excited. It's going to be on our next YouTube video with Sarkis's giveaway for guessing his car. Yeah. Um, so it's going to be a fun Friday YouTube episode, I think. But um, are we good on the podcast? 45. Mm-hmm. That's what we're doing now, right? 45? Whatever you guys want to do. I'm just here. Fucking down for 45. I don't know. I mean, either way. But but yeah, so the SF90 project is next. We have another Urus S wide body we're doing. Colin's coming up. New Colin project too. New Colin coming. We did a Novatech Colony, which was really nice. Um, we're not doing the Toyota. Spectre. Oh, Spectre. Shit, we're not even talking about that. Big development on yeah. Spectre. Our buddy Thatch. Mr. Thatch Nguyen. He... he is a big social media guy who uh, teaches how to flip and also invest in real estate uh, in Seattle. He's in Seattle, but he's he's very good at what he does. He came from you know no money, and uh, he's very successful now and teaches people. So he's a really a great uh, coach for real estate minded people. And uh, we've been doing his cars for several years now, shipping his cars from Seattle. Uh, we did. Like a flying spur, we did a dawn, we did a Bentley, right? Yeah, we did a flying spur. But, oh, I mean, did we did a bunch of cars for him, and now he got a Spectre, which he didn't even drive. He literally went to the dealer, saw it, put it on a flatbed, and they transported the car to us in LA. And we're going to be doing also the first body kit in the world for the Rolls Royce Spectre. So we're going to do two phases of that. The first phase is going to be wheels, some wrap stuff paint stuff um and we're going to show you guys and then the next phase which will be in may sometime will be a body kit so that's very exciting the specter is a great car it's starting to hit a little bit more i finally see i saw one or two on the street um it's a really really how come they don't make the engine one with engine or hybrid so like people who like should shovel a lot like (laughs) <laughs> I'm not people, talking for the rest of the podcast, you guys. People who like to it's, shovel. It's, the whole point of that Spectre is all electric. That's the whole point. No, I get it, but so there's. A but why would they? Why would? What the fuck was that? People who like to shovel. Okay, so for example, they go to like Vegas or San Francisco or. Like <laughs> don't go to Spectre. I don't know. Why not? You gotta stop and charge. <laughs> or charge it. You gotta charge with the peasants. <laughs> He and said, then, don't go with the Spectre. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, oh, you guys are great, man. Just don't judge the fucking Spectre to Vegas, man. What? Yeah, but it's comfy. Okay. It's a, what the fuck is going? <laughs> Instead of travel, you can shovel. <laughs> coffee? <laughs> They're fucked up. Instead of no, travel, it, no, it is a comfy car. It's a, like expensive car. You pull up in Vegas with the spectrum. Okay, then wheel. stop and charge it for a little bit. How do people do in Teslas? I don't know. No, this is, we have to accept this. This is a new fucking yeah, but thing. You, how many times did you see a, uh, people driving with Tesla? Everywhere. To so Vegas? Yeah. What are you talking about? Fuck Everywhere. Million, yeah? <laughs> what are you talking about? That's the best car to drive to Vegas. It's all Teslas when you drive yeah, to Vegas. Of course. What are you talking about, man? Tesla is the most. Isn't it the most? Haven't they made the most cars yeah. out of everybody in the world? Yeah. I think so, yeah. There's Go drive on the street. I guarantee you on the way home, yeah. you'll count more Teslas. No. Than so, like when I go to Glendale, I don't see Tesla. Bullshit, what man. What are you talking about? They're everywhere. They're everywhere. Mm-hmm. Teslas are everywhere, man. Well, the 1981. Yeah, so Spectre Project. What? 1981 Toyota for that you guys saw on the YouTube channel. Sucks. I don't think it's going to happen. We're trying to. We're talking about that. 
We're trying to find. Well, yeah, if it's not going to happen, we're definitely going to talk about. We're, it. Trying, to, we're trying to happen. finalize the deal, but it is a lot of work. It's a lot of work. So the car came from New York. Um, it's nostalgic to the customer. Sent it to us, obviously, to check it out and in hopes of doing a full restoration on it. And um, it came and it's filled with rust. Seventy one point six billion. Fucking insane yeah. number. Um, it's filled with rust all over. So Under how much is this the problem? body? Oh, this guy fucking <laughs> serious person? He's talking about something else. Bro, look at the number. You're on the mic and you're, you're overlapping what he's trying to say. But yeah, I know it's crazy. I don't mean he fucking started talking about the tour. And I'm, we're talking. Oh, yeah, yeah. You know. This guy's back in the still 10 minutes ago. Fuck. Tell me I can't make fun of him. Anymore. Tell him. Just tell him. Okay. But anyways, if you saw our last <laughs> YouTube video, you saw the 1981 Toyota Cressida. <laughs> Came from New York and uh, unfortunately needs too much work. We were trying to find parts for it. Almost impossible. We even found uh, another car. Thought about buying that. But the customer's budget, unfortunately, is not enough to do all that because he wants a good job on it. He wants it done right. But it's just too much work. And here at RDV, we never really reject much. It's very rare. But we know this car... It has to be good, and for the price, it's unfortunate that we can't get that done. Rust, as you guys know, if something's really rusted, you have to take it out. Yeah, um, you can't just bond over rust. You can't. So um, the fender literally has a hole in it from the rust. It's like eating it apart. Not just only the fender. We call rust cancer parts. for cars because um, it's like the worst thing for cars. It spreads, and, and yeah, you don't cut it. It's just what it is, and taking his money to do not a good job is also not the right thing to do here we want to be happy so, with the job too it's not just doing it and really so yeah. like you know at this point it got shipped here unfortunately and that costs money but uh we'll he's, see he's know. trying he's still trying maybe he could uh figure out a way to get <laughs> yeah. some more but but yeah i mean it's a cool car it's very very rare um the interior is pretty damn nice still it runs like pretty good needs like ac needs some stuff but, but is it like hundred thousand dollar for that car is it like special edition one that car i think that you could if that car i don't know how much that car is man 20 grand, 20 grand? Says, i think uh, i think a clean car would be like 30 35 because there is some for like 25 yeah, if, 20. yeah, yeah. Well, but they say mm. this is the special edition one he like, said one it's one of one, one. one. I, um, I don't know maybe I don't the know, color and stuff one. but if it's worth 100 grand then dump the money and do it but the problem is I, not. i don't stuff. think so no, no 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 yeah there was a fixed up one that was like 30 or 28 but um yeah so we're trying to figure out with the customer and hopefully we could do something but again we don't want to give any subpar yeah. work to somebody that's spending money and and is not happy with it you know so we're not trying to do that so we might do it we might not we'll see yeah still not a no but i hope i hope we get the uh the chance to do the repairs it'll be cool because remember see. guys our paint paint every year gets more expensive by the way so it's just getting expensive. you know people think that you could paint a car for Two grand, you can, but it's gonna look worse than it was. Um, for a proper, proper paint job with proper paint, proper clear coat, bond, whatever, whatever, costs a lot of money nowadays. So, well, you know how is what expensive it is? The, the sandpaper getting sandpaper. Everything's just more expensive now. It's just a way of life, like toothbrushes, you know. So, uh, thanks for watching the RDB podcast, and uh, maybe we'll give you one next week. We'll see, but do not miss Friday's YouTube episode. It's gonna be crazy. He said, now expensive the sun the paper. He said getting... sun the paper. Sun the paper. Oh my god. Sun paper. Sand. Yeah, sand. Paper. When you said sun the paper. Oh, we we shut shovel with the Rolls Royce. It's comfortable. <laughs>